Hi, this is Abstract Jazz, and welcome to another episode of Under the Radar. We're here today with Cash Kells. What's going on, Baltimore? So, Cash, can you tell, can I call you Cash? Is that cool? Okay. <laughs> so, how does it feel to have over 26,000 downloads on your mixtape? I mean, it feels good. I mean, I'm still pushing there, I mean, of course, that ain't enough. But um, I'm trying to get to a, a worldwide base. 26,000, cool, but it's like I know I could get more. You feel me? It's always better when you can get more. I mean, and it, it don't seem like I'm getting the type of... You feel me? I got 26,000, but I don't see the results or real from it. So I'm just still pushing for real. So it feel good, though. And tell us, what are some of your inspirations? Inspirations. I mean, I got a lot of inspiration. I mean, my kids, for real, it's like, well, they my motivation. But my inspiration is, I mean, a couple of people in the rap game. I just, I study constantly, listen to, like, Jadakiss. You feel me? Like, Meek Mill, they, like, my inspirations. Because they, they rap about the lifestyle, you feel me? And I can see that they really live it. And um, so I could say they could they be they be my motivation, my inspiration. What are some songs that you write about? I mean, what what kind of songs do you write about? What kind of songs I write about? I mean, I'm, I write about all kinds of stuff. I kind I try to stay relevant. You feel me to what's going on in the world for real? So I write about stuff that's going on in my life. You feel me? Like I got a song called Real Father. I don't know if y'all heard of that. That's about uh, my son. I'm going through that with my baby mother. Got a song about that. Uh, I just dropped No Justice, No Peace, according to what's going on in the world. You know what I mean? Government, how they treating us. You know what I mean? That's on SoundCloud. So, I mean, I rap about the trap and everything. I rap about basically what I live, basically. You know what I mean? So, all real. Can you tell us about any new music that you have? Yeah, like I said, I just dropped No Justice, No Peace like three days ago on SoundCloud. And uh, yeah, I just dropped that. Um, SoundCloud got about eight songs on it. It's a couple songs that's going to be on Facts Only. That's my up and coming mixtape coming up. Um, I'm planning to drop it in January. Um, I'm trying to get DJ Holiday to host it. And um, yeah, but if you go to my SoundCloud, you can listen to all the music I drop and um, keep up with me. And what is your overall goal as an entertainer? As an entertainer, my overall goal is just to reach my fans. I mean, sell records. I mean, I mean, I know it's hard these days to sell records, but I just want to reach my fans. I want my fans to be able to feel me, like to feel the same. Like it's, it's I, they came from where I came from. It's a lot of people that came from nothing. And if I do make it, I just want them to know that they can make it. So I want them to, yeah, that's basically. <laughs> yeah. Do you plan on signing a major deal or just remain, do you plan to remain independent? I mean, I'm really not into deals. I mean, I be looking at a lot of stuff in the industry. It don't be saying like it's right. Like nothing don't ever seem right. Look. It's all for the TV, it all look good on TV, but it don't be right, you feel me? So I'd rather really stay independent if I can, but if a major do, deal do come through, it gotta be right. Like, everything has to be right, like everything. I don't want no 360 deals, I want a regular, as though I can be able to be happy and not be stressing over the deal, you know? Okay, well thank you again for your time. Tune in next Sunday for new interviews only on Under the Radar. Yes. <laughs>